is a table of great victory. This table was looked upon as a time of defeat, but it really wasn't. It was a great moment of victory. As the Pharisees and the Sadducees and the scribes saw him nailed to the cross, Jesus nailed to the cross by the Roman soldiers, they thought they had won a great victory. But in fact, it was a victory for Jesus because although they put him in the grave, on the third day he rose again. And this morning as we partake of the communion, receive strength for your victories. We're going to sing Amazing Grace as the glasses and the bread are taken around. Jesus, make it an occasion of victory. I've heard many testimonies of people at the communion table who found great help. One brother came to me recently and said, as I took the bread into my lips, I asked God to come and heal me. And instantaneously there in the communion, I was healed. Another sister said how she was discouraged and lonely. And as she took the communion, she found comfort and strength from God. Let's stand, shall we, as we partake of the wonderful table of the Lord Jesus. Lord Jesus Christ, we thank you for dying upon the cross for us 2,000 years ago. We praise you that your blessings are still with us today. Thank you for this table. In Jesus' name, amen. Let's eat and drink together. We give you praise, Lord. We give you thanks for your blessings. We thank you for your goodness towards us. Praise you. Gift of the Spirit. Fred is going to lead us in one of the old hymns as we receive the glass.
church service of worship and communion came from the Assemblies of God Church at Clemsig in Adelaide. It was conducted by ministers of the church, Pastor Fred Evans, Pastor Andrew Evans, and Pastor Paul Newsham. The senior minister, Pastor Andrew Evans, was the preacher. The music was directed by the pianist, Ross Curtis, and the organist was Lorraine Evans.